In this video, we'll see how to set up product attributes and categories. Product attributes are details that apply to a particular product or category of products. The attributes can be used for tracking and analyzing purposes. An attribute has to have an attribute type. So let's look at that first. We'll go to product information management, set up categories and attributes, attribute types. And we'll create a new type. And this type will be for t-shirts and it will be to detail whether they have sleeves or not. So we'll call this sleeved. And this will be a yes or no attribute. So it will be a Boolean. We notice the fixed list is not available for this type. So we'll save this and create a new one. And this one will be for the type of sleeve. So sleeve type. This time we'll have a text attribute and we want the list to be fixed. We'll toggle this and we have values here. We'll add, first of all, long or long sleeve, then short. And lastly, no sleeves, none. Now we've set up the attribute types, we'll set up the attributes back to the menu and attributes. And we'll create a new attribute. We'll call it the same name as our attribute type. Sleeved, we'll find that attribute type we've just created. And when we save that, another toggle will appear here, which is our default value, which we are going to set to yes. And here are more toggles for attribute metadata, self-explanatory. So we'll save this and create a new attribute. And once again, the same name we'll use as the type. We'll find that attribute type And this time when we save, the toggle will allow us to set a default text value and we'll use the long as the default. Now we've created two attributes specific to our t-shirts. We'll put them in an attribute group. Back to the main menu, attribute groups. We'll create a new group and we'll call this T sleeves and we'll add our attributes we created a moment ago. Find those, select, add to the group, OK. Now we will add our new group to a category hierarchy. We use category hierarchies to classify products or transactions for reporting and analysis. For example, when we create a product, we assign it to a product category. So we'll go to our category hierarchies and we'll select from the tree already, we'll select fashion and from here, We'll look at the category attribute groups and add our new group that we created. We'll find that it was T sleeves. Select that and add. And we see here the attributes for that group and we click OK.